Today, I'm going to show you how to make a cigarette receptacle, cigarette urn receptacle, smoker's pole, Smoking those standing pole. ashtray things. Anyway, online they're like $170, ridiculous, plus you gotta pay shipping. Um, they're just really convenient, so if you, you know, smoke outside your house, there's butts everywhere, and uh, you're sick of throwing it in a can or stomping on cigarette butts, I'm gonna show you how to do it for under $10. I do you know you want one. You can get everything you need at your local dollar store. Good thinking! This is awesome! Do some tricks, man. Yeah! Tricks! Woo! Drive to your local Dollar Tree. God, I love the Dollar Tree. Frozen dinners, pencils, plates, trash cans, frozen dinners, all types of shit, bro. Dollar Tree! If you don't have one in a neighborhood near you, drive to a neighborhood that's not near you because it'll be worth it. Drive your ass to your Dollar Tree with five bucks and get the necessary utensils in order to make yourself a goddamn smoking pool! Woo! Smoking pools! Dude, I'm getting excited. I'm just rolling up to this place. It's where I come to splurge, baby. Balling on a budget. Wiffle ball bat. One dollar. Bucket. One dollar, man. That's one dollar, Frank. Okay. Forget about it. Razor blade. One dollar! Super glue, one dollar. Duct tape, one dollar. One motherfucking dollar. Tortilla warmers, one dollar. And Fabuloso, one dollar. Dollar. Garage sale. Rage. Cotton candy. Killing them. That's hot. Pitching rubber. Oh dear. Yo, if there be pain, zebra murders. Oh. So that's the bucket, the wiffle ball bag, on this shit. the tortilla warmer, the duct tape, the super glue. And the razor blade. Wiffle ball bat. Smoking pool! So the bat, you're gonna wanna first off cut the bottom. Off of the bat. Good okay. thinking! As well as some type of hole here. Um, obviously. I mean, to cut the end off. Self explanatory. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Looks pretty good, yeah. It looks pretty good, yeah. Easy. Light cake, baby. Kind of just put the end of the bat down on here. You know, try to make sure it's centered and oh, great job. <laughs> outlined with the sharpie. Uh, it took me a few tries because you know, once it's on there, you can't really see where the middle is. You know, so actually, I think it might be easier to do it on the, on this side. It just seems uh, like a better idea. Like that sun. Now cutting the hole in the top here, 
biggest pain in the ass part of the whole uh, project. Great work! Got it. Not too bad. Cut a hole in the center there. In the center, good to go. Here. So stick the bat in there. Like so. That looks amazing. And then, um, you know, finagle some duct tape around the bottom here. If you have any other ideas, go for it. But, uh, you know, get it as level as you can. And then just reinforce it here for stability and function. Oh, yeah. I just super glued the shit out of the lid or onto the lid. Good thinking! On your tortilla warmer thing once you get both holes in there. And then I just have some regular, you know, tape, boxing tape or whatever. You can use duct tape or whatever kind of tape. Or you can just sit there and uh, hold it together if you want until it dries, okay? I opted for the tape. Once I get that kind of level, you know, eyeball it. You don't want this, you know, bat sticking out. On an oh, angle. great job! Once I kind of got it positioned and everything, I went to the bottom and wrapped some more duct tape around there just to kind of keep it secure uh, into where I want it. And I'm sure there's other ways to do it that are more professional, but this is the cheapest way. Great craftsmanship! Probably want to throw some sand, dirt, rice, kitty litter, rocks, pennies. Oh yeah, I got lots of pennies! Blau! That's basically what we got here. Get on this um, shit! Nah, I made this one kind of short. I'm putting it in my backyard. You know, we all smoke sitting down on chairs and stuff, so kind of wanted it at um, that kind of height. Obviously, if you want it higher, you know, I have about, you know, eight inches of the bat down here. You know, you just want to, you know, lift that and adjust it accordingly. But, um, paint it. I'm just going to use some cheap spray paint, and we're good to go. Smoking bold! There it is. Yes! Balling on a budget!